Katie, what was your personal reaction and what you thought the team reaction to the LeBron news and then also did, did his absence come up in this halftime conversation you, you mentioned? Uh, um, it was something that was unexpected for sure. Um, found out this morning, you know, did more testing and you know, we didn't really hear anything afterwards. You know, woke up from the nap and any media outlet that covers anything <laughs> headed on and said that he was uh he was in the health and safety protocol. So um it wasn't like a, a shocker for us. We just said we can't catch a break, you know, we was getting guys back and then you know he's out for how many days we don't know. Uh, it was all depending on, you know, the situation. But um but you still still gotta find ways to win, you know. Um we can't let that affect us. You know, obviously he's a, a huge part of our team, but um but then we played a huge amount of games without him. Um so we kinda know how that is already. Um and we gotta continue to play like we did on the defensive end, you know, until he's able to come back and guys gonna have to continue to step up. You know, Malik stepped up Wayne, and Doe, Dwight, Melo, all these guys came in and played some big minutes. So um you know, we're gonna continue to need that from these guys.